Tuesday, Hudson County TV returned to the Newark Federal Courthouse to once again get some coverage of the West New York Mayor Felix Roque's federal hacking trial. Despite McDonald's best efforts to get Special Agent Heron to say the Recall Roque website was about intimidation and harassment, the FBI agent ultimately said, My role was to do a forensic investigation of the Roque smartphones. I didn't have an investigative role in the case. Azzarello then spoke to Heron at length about a long sequence of emails between Jeffrey Reynoso, really Joseph Roque, and Maria Pasquale, actually Jose Munoz. While it was clear that Pasquale had no intention of meeting face-to-face, Haram refused to speculate as to the reason why. After the lunch break, Azzarello argued that Munoz had wiped his computer clean of all information pertaining to RecallRoque.com, a pivotal aspect of the case that was being ignored. However, Assistant U.S. Attorney Judd Well retorted that an FBI agent is obtaining all data on the matter and that the point was a moot one in the case anyway. Megan McCarville, a Microsoft compliance manager, said that the Jeffrey Reynoso Hotmail account changed the password for RecallRoque.com three times on February 8, 2012, once again tracing the incident via the IP address. Richard Huffaker, the Director of Education and Policy for Weebly.com, said that once again, an IP address indicated that Joseph Roque was the one who changed the password, deleted content, and then the account hosted on the Weebly service. The court broke relatively early today at 4 p.m., and tomorrow we're expected to see the victims from the criminal complaint, at least a couple of them, make an appearance in the courthouse. I'm John Hyde of County TV. For more information, log on to HudsonCountyTV.com.